All actions and procedures shown in this video are placed exclusively in good faith for self-help people with similar problems. The author disclaims any responsibility for any type of damage caused by using these advices, which means that you're responsible for carrying out the same and also for possible physical or non-physical damage of any kind incurred with these advices. This video will show you how to try to fix the B200 error on the Canon IP7250 printer. This error code is also known on other Canon models, and by searching the internet, you will find several types of tips to solve the problem. The printer with this error is unable to print the assigned document, and before he's showing the window with the error B200, it can be heard quite long the work of its mechanics. The error message indicates that the printer need to go to a service, but maybe not because you probably can fix it yourself. I found a solution which suggests washing print head under running hot tap water. On the, the first look I was skeptical, but as the printer was 5 years old, and maybe it was time to buy another, I decide to try that method. Job need to be done is that the printer must be unplugged from the AC power cord and the USB cable that is connected to the computer. Then open the A compartment with a moving print head who have ink cartridges on itself and place it manually in the middle. After that, take out all the ink cartridges in a row and arrange them by order to later return them easy to their place. Then, using both hands, you pull a mechanical frame that holds the print head fixed in its cradle. When you complete that, you can pull out print head relatively easily. Now wash your print head under the running hot tap water, as shown in the video, until all ink comes out of it and starts flowing clean water. When that happens you have washed all ink and you can lightly wipe the whole print head so that all the extra moisture comes out, and on the end wipe all pin contacts it with a lint free cloth.
Now wash your print head under the running hot tap water, as shown in the video, until all ink comes out of it and starts flowing clean water. When that happens you have washed all ink and you can lightly wipe the whole print head so that all the extra moisture comes out, and on the end wipe all pin contacts it with a lint free cloth. After that, return your print head to its place in reverse order from removing it. There you have to be careful not to do anything by the force. You need to notice the logic how plastic mechanical frame hold tight print head in place, maybe it's a little hassle, but turn out on the end very simply. Then return the ink cartridges to their places. Theoretically, you could immediately connect the printer to your computer and test is it everything work ok, but I would nevertheless, on the basis of my experience, advise you to wait a few hours for unnecessary moisture to evaporate at room temperature. I went to test the printer immediately, but I got the again message about B200 error and I thought I did not do anything smart. After some 6 to 7 hours I tested it again and the printer did not show the B200 error anymore, which was pleasant surprise. However, the printer failed to print test pattern right, but the printer was ok without any indication of the B200 error. This test pattern print error I solved after a one normal and two deep print head cleaning through the printer driver. The printer then printed the test pattern properly and for now everything works ok. How long and how will last we will see it in the future. If I didn't solve this problem on this way, I would probably go to the option of purchasing a replacement print head that can be found in a price range of 15 to 70 US dollar on eBay and similar sites. Thanks for watching.